Hi guys, um, Nick Stendervid here again. Um, welcome to another video in my series. This is just a very, very quick video on how I use um, a software called Lead Pages um, online to create all of my lead pages, uh, capture pages, opt in pages, thank you pages, etc. etc. I just want to show you um, how simple it is to create a landing page um, using Lead Pages, an opt in page. Um, it really is very, very easy and very, very quick. So um, I'm just going to go ahead and look. If you this, this is this is um, leadpages.net, uh, and once you join up, there is a um, a monthly uh, uh, um, charge. I think it's sixty seven dollars a month for the package that I'm on, and I think it might be the basic package is thirty four dollars a month something like that um my link at the it will be at the bottom of this video so if you are interested in having a little look at lead pages have a little look through my link um and see how you get on <clears throat> but like as i say so going back to what um, i'm doing here as you can see when you're um you come into lead pages and you've got your account active um you will see i mean this is templates okay all so um excuse me i'm losing the plot here right so um as you can see, there is absolutely loads of options for you to create a fantastic squeeze page, webinar page, um, Facebook giveaway page. Um, it's, everything's there for you to, to do, uh, sorry, for you to use. Um, sales pages, um, there's, there's just, it's just brilliant. Video, video squeeze page, excuse me. So yeah, so absolutely fantastic resource. So um, I'm just going to show you how to create a very very quick opt-in page um, using lead pages. Um, uh, you you will also need when you create an opt-in page, you will need a, an autoresponder. My personal favourite is uh, Aweber, and what lead pages does is actually connects or you connect for it. You connect a, um, your, your Aweber account with lead pages. So when you actually come to create these pages, no code is necessary. Um, so you don't got to worry about HTML code, PHP code, anything like that. It is all done for you and it's very, very simple. So let's just have a little look, very, very, very basic. There we go. Let's just use this new basic squeeze page. <clears throat> we'll slurp my tea while it's loading. Okay, so um, you've got here you know, a little logo that you can change. I'm, I'm just going to make a, um, a few changes to this just to sort of show you how, how very easy it is. I've got a few um, logos and stuff that I'm using. I'm going to use my advertising page logo there. I'm going to... Did I change the background image? Let's change the background image just to show you how easy it can be. Um, let's put that one in there. Should do in the very second. There we are. Okay. Um, right. Let's change this uh, here. Um, free report on how to make money every twenty minutes. Okay, so enter your email just to get this free report. Don't need to do that. Download the report. Sounds good. Okay, so then you pl click this one here, which is the opt-in button. So this is the first page that people are going to see. Um, so we'll keep that there because I quite like this. Uh, almost there. Please complete this form. I quite like that as well. Right, uh, enter your email just below to reserve. I quite like that as well, but I'm going to change this image to... Let's change it to that one. Okay. Like that. Um, I personally, because I find it converts higher for me, I just keep it as email only. Um, but then you just go to integration settings. Once you've once you've integrated your Aweber account or whatever um, <coughs> um, autoresponder you use, it will.
I'm going to pause this video just for one sec because I can see I'm having a little bit of an issue here. Just bear with me a second. <clears throat> okay, sorry about that, guys. I do apologise. Okay, so basically, it's taken around about three minutes for me to sort that out. Um, when because I hadn't um, had this open, my integration settings had dropped, so I needed to reintegrate with Aweber. Um, so now, if I go to here now, you can see that um, Aweber is loaded and it finds all of my um, lists from within um, Aweber and you choose the list that you want to um, use and then obviously you click OK and then it, it the form fields reload um, and you can uh, you know obviously it's saved now and so basically when people, someone puts their email address in it goes to your Aweber list okay um, now obviously there's there's a lot of forms a lot of things you can change on this form um, style here um, and I'm going to go through tracking and stuff in a minute I just want to close that um, I'm going to save that very, very quickly. I'll call it example page just for the minute. Okay, so now it's just going to quickly save. As you can see, that that, that loads, that image loads um, very, very slowly. So I, I, I wouldn't use that image because it's too high res. Anyway, that's that's a, that's another another thing. Um, so. You know the basic um, basic page is there now. I don't know if any of you uh, know about tracking or whatever else. I'll probably do a video about tracking because it's extremely important when you're using any form of traffic, whether it's free or paid, to use some form of tracking. And what Lead Pages um, gives you, it gives you a tracking code option. So again, you haven't got to worry about any coding. Um, it will tell you, you know, your, your, your tracker will tell you where it wants the code to be put. Because um, there'll be elements of scripts that you need to put in, so to um, you know from Google Analytics or I personally use CPV Lab um, for all of my tracking. But basically, it will tell you where to put the code. Um, and in Lead Pages, it gives you this option. So you put the code um, in here, for instance, or whatever. And once you press Done and Save, um, your tracking code is already automatically put into the HTML code, so you haven't got anything to worry about. Um, where it comes to here, that these are extra tracking codes where, like for instance, my CPV lab, if it goes through that, then it needs to add a, a sub and it shows it in the in the report. So I need to put in bits and pieces in here. Um, so anyway, moving on. <coughs> very, very quickly, once someone opts in, you get um, an option to either redirect to... Um, uh, the offer or you can redirect directly to a thank you page I I personally especially in this niche I prefer to go to a thank you page where I'm possibly introducing myself or whatever so you know you have the option you put the thank you page um, uh, or your redirect page in there you press OK um, and that that basically is it so what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna try and um, I'm gonna pause the video Actually, I'm gonna. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put in my. Uh, just bear with me. I'm going to put in. My, my advertising page referral link. Okay. I'm gonna publish that now. And that shows you what the page um, is called, and you can view the page there. So I'm going to just grab that. I mean, analytics as well, by the way, guys. If you buy the full package, um, lead pages do a analytics at the back. So here we go. Um, let's just see. My email address has just been loaded in there. So I'm going to download the report. <laughs> already subscribed to that list so that's fantastic just bear with me right sorry about that now what I've done I've actually deleted myself off the um, out of my uh, um, Aweber account so I can show you hopefully it'll work now so so download the report as you can see in internet marketing there's always issues and there's a redirect <clears throat> simple as that okay um, because it, I'm, I'm on um, a certain list um, the welcome email has now gone out to that email address and that is using lead pages 
um, for opt-in pages and thank you pages and um, you know building your list. So thanks very much for watching. Sorry it was a little bit all over the place, so I do apologise about that. Um, but if you do want to know anything else, and I did say there's a uh, there's a link at the bottom of here for the, for, for lead pages, so please click on that. Um, if you want to know anything else, give me a contact. Um, onlinehelpwithnick at gmail.com. Thank you very much for watching. Much appreciated.